The part we added on um, includes the governor's proposed three tax credit programs to help build out the child care infrastructure. Um, the Missouri Chamber of <coughs> Commerce released a new report that found Missouri misses out on $1.35 billion annually, including a $280 million annual loss in tax revenue just due to health care issues alone. Additionally, 28% of respondents in that report said that they or someone in their household left a job or did not take a job because of problems with child care. So we want to address those issues. Um, the three credits include a child care contribution tax credit, an employer provided child care assistance, and um, child care provider tax credit. So we're using different tools um, to really target both the bus business community, community involvement, and um, to prop up those providers themselves. We also appreciate that there is emphasis on building up our child care workforce. The workforce of all industries across Missouri relies upon the availability of our child care workforce. A nurse in Franklin County isn't going to be able to go to the emergency room for their shift if their child care provider shut down. Um, a critical utility worker in St. Louis isn't going to be able to go repair that down power line if they don't have someone to watch their children. Uh, we also really believe that this bill and this package goes a long way in building out our capacity within our child care network, which is really, really important. Um, employers want to support their employees. I know our members believe employees are their greatest asset, and this program and these proposals uh, ensure that employers have skin in the game in investing in their, child, their employees' child care costs. It's not a one-to-one -one match. Um, but I think it's going to go a long way in getting employers in the mindset to start thinking about child care benefits almost like health care benefits.